What a time to be alive. A beautiful summary of today. This will go down in history. The future is now. Holy shit. Potentially the biggest news this week, or possibly all time, happened just a couple of days ago. No, it wasn't President Obama telling a heckler to get out of his house. This news literally changed people's lives, perhaps for the worse. Harry Styles held up a Swedish flag in a Swedish concert. I know, right? Holy shit! There may have also been an image of one of the most retweeted tweets of all time on the back. Now if you didn't know, Larry is the name for the couple that is Harry and Lee Louis. In other words, they're saying they're gay. Or bisexual. Either way, they're saying they're a couple, so gay, bisexual, or friends with benefits. Also, thanks to Miss Horny, I now realise that if you say Larry is fake and you don't believe in it, you could potentially die. Thankfully for us, she came up with a legit 100% scripted situation. Oh my god, did you see the video where a girl threw furry handcuffs on stage at a One Direction concert? Harry showed them to Louie and Louie was like... Later. For the purposes of this video, this is the only prop I've got. It's a girl wearing a scarf. Classic Larry moment. They probably did it backstage. That means sex. Now, if you didn't know, all of this did actually start all the way back in 2011, when Louis made a tweet saying Harry would always be in his heart. And four years on, Harry is holding up a Swedish flag which he probably did think was a Swedish flag, with this tweet on the back. So he picks up the Swedish flag, puts it behind him, thinking the Swedish flag is gazing behind him, when really he's holding up this heartful tweet. This basically means that there are devious directioners out there. So you might want to watch your wallets, guys, because they do need some new Larry posters. Twitter has since been hijacked, stolen, abused, and fondled by hordes of young, passionately crazy people. And if any of you crazy motherfuckers are watching this video right now, please do not kill me. So intrigued to find out what Larry was about, I typed Larry into the Twitter search and found out that shit had got serious. Shit had hit the fan and Poland was even invaded for 18 hours. Now being curious, in fact, curious is not the right word. Wondering what the fuck was going on, I decided to open the Twitter door and peek through. And on behalf of you guys, closed the door, locked it, and ran away with this. A picture of two girls eating bananas. However, one is saving hers. Okay, I'm sorry, forgive me. I know it wasn't two girls. One of them was the Beebs. No, but in all seriousness, I saw tweets claiming the future is now with Louis and Harry pushing babies. Tweets claiming Larry would go down in history. A girl with the top of her head cut off tweeting, what a time to be alive. One person couldn't explain how much they loved Larry because their dictionary wasn't big enough. One didn't need a dictionary, she just set herself on fire. Someone wanted to be fucked. One asked to be deleted from the universe. Delete, delete, delete. The fuck? Get the fuck back to school and learn that you're not living in a fucking computer. However, then things started getting extremely dark. Someone, someone probably homophobic, posted another hashtag. This got people even more crazy. Yeah, because they weren't crazy enough already. The hashtag was Larry is not real, but disgusting. I know, right? I bet all your faces right now are matching this. Manda summed this up perfectly. Apparently Manda also wears a scarf. 
Honey, listen to me. Anybody, anybody cares if you don't like Larry. If you think they're disgusting, then maybe you're blind or a stupid homophobic. Larry is the most beautiful couple in this fucking world full of homophobics. Just look at them. Check the way they look at each other. I'm imagining she's crying whilst typing this, by the way. Their love is palpable. So we go from anybody cares to palpable. Basically means you can feel the way they look at each other. Feel it. And then she blabbles on and signs it with a heart. This then turned in to an anti-Larry hunt, where people were telling the anti-Larry people to turn on their locations so they could hunt them down and smile at them. Which, to be fair, would probably be quite terrifying. It then moved on to murder, throwing people out of a window, and... Oh wait, shit. An actual supporter of the hashtag. Oh, and by the way, Hedgehog and one girl was so excited, Enrid, that she had to tweet the same thing twice. So as you can see, the One Direction fandom is another world, and potentially, two of One Direction could be gay. 